In this behind the scenes video, I'm gonna be talking about recording ambient sound for a video, but rather than using a regular directional mic or maybe a stereo mic on top of the camera, I'm actually using the Lark 150 from Hollyland. As you can see, these are regular clip-on mics. I could simply clip them on to my jacket right here, but I'm not gonna use them like that. I'm gonna position them differently and that way I can record stereo sound. So let's see how well that works. Since the final video is gonna be rather short, I really try to get the best out of it audio-wise. So for most of the shots, I'm using both microphones, like I mentioned before, to get a nice dual stereo sound. And the best way to do it with this tiny river right here is to put both microphones down. I'm gonna place the first one right here and the other one on the opposite side facing this direction. As you can see, the audio channels react differently because the microphones are facing in different directions, meaning they pick up different sounds. And that's also a good way in case you don't have any headphones to check your audio to see whether or not they're actually picking up different kind of soundtracks. <laughs> It's actually quite challenging for me because I'm used to pretty much just using a microphone that sits on top of the camera and records the audio lavaliers or yeah, clip-on mics like these are usually only used to record interviews whenever a person speaks, but not really for ambient sound, even though you could say it's obvious because stereo microphones in the end are just two microphones pointing slightly in different directions. That's how you get nice different two channels. And it's the same with this. Of course, you can do much more with these. They are not actually made for this type of recording, but I thought it's a nice challenge. From my own experience, it often makes sense to record audio and video separately. And what I mean by that is that often the scene doesn't really fit together with the audio or vice versa. Meaning maybe you have a beautiful shot at a park with nice flowers, maybe some birds flying but the actual audio is horrible. Maybe you hear cars honking, maybe there's a highway close by, so the result wouldn't actually fit to the image. So there's nothing wrong with recording the audio separately, meaning maybe you go somewhere else, capture the audio up close and vice versa. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.